The case that captivated the Carolinas back in the spotlight. It's been nearly two years since little Jordan Dumont was found dead near her Gaston County home. Police say the three-year-old was killed by her mother's boyfriend, William McCullen. McCullen was arrested back in August of 2016, charged with first-degree murder. Today, lawyers will pick the jury that will determine whether he is guilty. The trial moved to Cleveland County because there was so much media attention even. NBC Charlotte's Ariel Placencia now live at the courthouse. And Ariel, give us an idea of what exactly we can expect today. Well, Ben, jury selection is going to begin in just a few hours around 10 a.m., and that'll happen for at least another two or three days, so we'll keep you posted on that. But I've been doing some digging into McCullen's criminal history, and you may remember we actually were talking about him a few months ago, and that's because in February he was charged with having drugs while in jail. But he's also facing another charge that landed him behind bars in the first place, and that's first-degree murder. And jury selection for that trial begins today. Is why. Tell me why. Tell me how you could do it to a three-year-old innocent child. For a still grieving Gaston County community, many hoping the murder trial for William McCullen will provide answers to the many questions that still remain. We did some digging and found the now 27-year-old McCullen is no stranger to the law. His criminal record dates back to 2008 and includes charges such as possession of marijuana. After the toddler's body was found in August 2016, search warrants show illegal drugs and weapons were found inside his Bessemer City home. And speaking of that house, police said officers were called out dozens of times over the past three years before little Jordan's death. We don't know that all those calls are specific to this couple or to these individuals, just that there's been 49 calls. Some questioning why Jordan's mother didn't do more to protect her daughter. So many people feel that she should be charged as well because how do you keep your kids in an environment like that? So again, jury selection beginning in just a few hours from now, 10 a.m. We're going to be inside that courthouse you see behind me, and we'll, of course, let you know what happens. Live in Cleveland County, I'm Ariel Placencia, NBC Charlotte.